let's check what card is on your iPhone. Now, if you're on your iPhone and you're wondering which specific credit card or debit card is being billed for a number of different things, I'm gonna walk you through the entire process. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks guys. Now there are three different places where a credit card might be. One is your Apple wallet. Another one is basically the autofill when you're in Safari and you're basically checking out and buying something. And then the third option is in your app store when you're buying apps or subscriptions within apps. I'll walk you through all of those. The first one, let's head into the settings here. Scroll down and tap on wallet and Apple Pay. Now on here, you can see payment cards. I have a couple of different credit cards and debit cards on here. Now you can just tap on any of these and you'll be able to see basically the transaction. You can go to the info here and get more information about that specific card that is linked on there. Keep in mind this wallet and Apple Pay is when you go up to a cash register, you're buying a coffee or something and you just double click and use your Apple Pay to buy something. However, a different credit card is in, say, Safari. So let's go into Safari, scroll down to Autofill, and then Saved Credit Cards. Now, this will show you various credit cards that are linked to your Safari. This is if you're buying something online, say you're on Amazon.com and you're buying something and it says, all right, now you need to fill in your credit card information. It will autofill from these cards. Now, the last thing that you can check is the card associated with your app store. Now, these are for in-app purchases or buying paid for apps, stuff like that. To find that out, let's go to the app store, tap on your profile at the very top, right? And then on here, we can tap on your profile name and picture at the very top. This will pop up with your account settings. And on here, all we need to do is tap on manage payments. Now you'll be able to see yet another card on here at the very top and it says this is your default payment method for the App Store if you're buying or renewing any subscriptions or anything within the App Store. Of course, any of these, you could always change them. You could change the billing address or the mailing address, any of those different things. You could remove those cards, add a card, it doesn't really matter. You have complete control on all of that stuff. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks, guys.